heb niks iets wat ik heb in al een huisje. Right up there, look. Look, up there. Some of my sheepies, look. Look, three little sheepies, they got away. Oh, they might be going to Smith's Coombe. It was a lovely walk. I really enjoyed that and I think I would enjoy... Uh, I wouldn't do that for a bit. I'd go down the gate there and go straight down and round. Now I've done that, you see, now that I've explored. Yeah, another time I would... I would walk the opposite way. And I would come up that coom because you do see things in a different light when you're coming up. I wonder if that old couple went there, some um, an old couple really struggling, a man is particularly, but he was determined to get up there, bless him. I think he's probably said, Look, if it takes me two hours, I'm getting up here. He looked very, very breathless. And, uh, well, I'm getting breathless, but. That, look at that little sheepy looking, thinking, can I trust you, Sheila? Of course you can. You can trust me. through there, look. So I've just stood there going down now. There's another comb to explore. You could actually go down that one round and come up the other one. You could kill two birds at one stone then. Right folks, I'm going down to Smith's Coombe. I've met a few people out. Got behind your guard, there's some... Sometimes that people that lurk. Blokes. Always got to be a bit careful of them, they look a bit like... From the distance. <laughs> they look like uh, the bloke out of Halloween, Michael. Oh, I've got to be careful. I don't want a stalker after me. I'm very alert like that, though. I notice people. I notice people. Look, there's a lone... Oh, look, there's some bar sheeps. I'm just keeping an alert eye out now. Hello, sheepies. Hello, look at that one in the middle of the track, look, saying, oh, come on Sheila, we've, we escaped the bikers. We've been waiting for you to come back. Hi Sheila, we know you're kind. Hello darlings, hello darlings. I can hear a quad bike mine. I 
I'm just doing a bit of videoing because I came up here on a very, very hot summer's day during the heat wave. It was. I'd been doing a lot of exploring over Kilv and um, that area. And one day I thought to myself, I need to come over here and do Smith's Coombe because what it is. Smith's Coombe sticks out by these lovely trees. So I'm just a little bit on more alert again because of somebody lurking earlier. It, just, it was just weird how they were lurking. Um, they, give, they give me the creeps, put it that way. In Halloween yet. Yeah, so I have these trees. They look a little bit more um, exhausted now, put it that way, even though they're evergreens. I can see this sort of place that deer would come, though. Deer would come here. So I'm just, it's not easy actually walking down, it's quite slippery. There's views over there. Today's not very good for dist what I call distant views though. Not very good for what I call distant views. Beautiful, aren't they? Look. This is quite a steep but bit of the wood here. But look at these. I don't know if it'll come out very well. It's sort of gone dark. It happened once before when I'd done something on here. Everything came out dark. Right, I'm going to turn off for a minute, take some photos.